Today I'm going to try and forge an acorn. So this is something that we, well I've done before in a stamping tool underneath the power hammer and so it's something that generally in that they're sort of production pieces you know and we're just stamping them out under the power hammer and they're all the same but I want to try and just forge one by hand and see how easy or tricky this is going to be. just going to put a little upset on the end of the bar so we've got a bit more mass. I'm doing it just on the edge of the stand here because this bar's really long. I really need to get myself an upsetting block. Be much easier then. An acorn has a very steep taper on the end. So that's what I'm going to try and forge now. Check that I haven't got any fish lips forming, but we seem to be okay. An acorn has a bit of like a cap on the end of it before the point of the acorn. So to make that, I'm gonna use this little die here. So I put this anvil on the floor so I can get the bar, put it in, and then upset it down. And this sort of has a bit of a recess in it. And so hopefully that will then create that shoulder on the cap. Got a nice short heat on it. Beginning to get a bit of a shoulder on it. Take another heat. Using these two 10mm bars, I'll neck the material in behind the acorn so it's running now back into the branch. As I said before, when I've done this, I've stamped them out under a power hammer, and so that's sort of just in a tool, you just run the power hammer at full whack on it, and you sort of don't really have to think about it. Whereas this, I really enjoyed making this, because it was just sort of something in my head that I thought, how can you create the shoulder on the acorn? And so I came up with that little tool, which we then upset it into, which worked rather well, actually. I've Just to finish the piece off, I've scrolled it, just to give it a bit more form and so this would usually be used on a gate or something like that as a finial but you can you know you can get a bit fancy and put it on a branch with oak leaves and whatever you know it's it's just a simple well not really simple but a way to make acorns that I've come up with by doing it by hand rather than stamping them out under a power hammer anyway I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you soon <laughs>